Hey everyone, how's everyone doing today? My name is Gina, I'm doing great. Welcome back to my studio vlog, even though I've not been vlogging at all this week. It is Friday, June the 16th. Happy birthday if it's your birthday. Um, I have not done much this week in my studio because, I'm going to show you in a bit, Barry and I on Tuesday took down all of my jasmine to get ready for the fence. The fence guy came Monday, so we had to work on that. Um, we're keeping the chain link fence up uh, because to take it down and to put up a new fence, they would have to go on her property. And I was like, mm -mm, no, she'll, mm -mm, no. So we're just going to put the privacy fence inside the chain link fence. So, it is what it is, but it, I just cannot wait for it to get done. I've been waiting for when they're going to come out and do it. Um, so, yeah. Uh, I have been planning things, just not doing things. <laughs> um, so, I want to make a summer flag. I have been thinking about that. Uh, and I have an idea. I think with the mushrooms, I'm still so obsessed with them. But I want to wait, I think, until fall and do something with them in the fall. Because I feel like mushrooms are more of a fall type thing, you know. Um, and, you know, fall is just right around the corner. And I actually need to be working on them to get them ready for fall, you know. So, um, I'm going to kind of switch gears and start working on my watermelon flag that I want to do summer flag it's gonna have watermelons in it did I say that well I just did so there you go <laughs> uh, but let me show you what I'm going to use as a border which I think is gonna be super cute I got these infusible ink sheets off of Amazon in this plaid checkered buffalo whatever you want to call it um, print it's like Mother's Day, Valentine's Day, something like that, I don't know. But I thought it would be cute to use probably this color um, on it uh, because that's like watermelonish. You know, it's got a lot of red in it. Uh, the pink may be okay because there's some pink. Uh, but these are really cute. Ooh, that would be great for fall, wouldn't it? I think so. So, um, I'm going to use this on the border on the top and the bottom I think not on the sides but on the top and the bottom and then in the middle I will have the watermelon in the same what I want to do so I'm excited I've never used these before <laughs> so of course I'm gonna have to test them out so I'm gonna use one of these sheets that I probably will never use because you know I just don't like it but and I don't know which one because they all look really pretty I mean, I really like these. And they weren't too bad either. I think it was just $9 for these. I don't know if that was a good deal or not. Because, like I said, I've never used them. So, but I'm excited about working on that. Um, I still, I, today, I'm definitely starting the terracotta <laughs> mushroom. I'm going to film it. And um, hopefully, if I can edit it, I can get it up by tomorrow. I know my art videos usually go up on Friday, but, uh, you know, circumstances and such. But, um, I'm, I was really sad about my jasmine. I did cry a couple of times. I'm not going to lie. Y'all, I boohooed when I cut my tree down. I knew I was going to cry about my jasmine. I've been growing it for 12 years. And it was going down the fence like I wanted it to. And all of that. And I just was heartbroken that I had to cut it. But for privacy, state of mind, you know, I had to do what I had to do. Um, but I'm kind of excited about getting the fence um, for, you know, just to do the backyard a little differently than what it was. Um, since we're moving the fence up, um, we're the big, here, let me just show you. Come with me. Okay, so this window right here, you can look out 
and see their house, their driveway, and all of that. That's why I've been keeping this closed. Look, I've been keeping everything closed. I even put a towel up <laughs> so I don't have to see over into their yard because you can totally see through all my windows, these three, their backyard, and all of that. Um, but the fence is going to come up past this window and up, you know, and all that. So I'm gonna put a bird bath and some bird feeders right here so that I know it sounds cruel, <laughs> but you know, my kitties like to watch the birds, so it'll give them some of it. Plus then I can see the birds too. Uh, so yeah, I'm just gonna be happy when I can actually open my blinds again. That's my D&D &D corner. <laughs> yes, with our D&D &D globe. <laughs> So, uh, I wasn't speaking during this because she was home, but I'm showing you where my jasmine went, and it went all the way over, and then there it is. And it's carnage. Sad. That's how much jasmine it was. So, yeah, uh, I had my little corner. It was great. Here I'm just showing my bush that we cut down to. Here are the mushrooms. I did today. The uh, art video should already be up. Didn't they turn out cute? I love them. Well, um, I did not work on my watermelon idea because now I have to edit this video so I can get it up for tomorrow. Not this video. The art video. <laughs> so I can get it up for tomorrow. But, um... I don't know if I'm going to finish this vlog right now or uh, maybe add Monday, but usually I just go Monday through Friday. Uh, yeah, so I don't know. We'll probably put it together because this will be a very short vlog, I think. I don't know. Well, good Tuesday, June the 20th to you. Happy birthday, if it is your birthday. So sorry about the noise. I have the main air going for the house and then I have my little portable air for out here so sorry about the noise but should be quick here um, I created my flag that I wanted to do my summer flag so I'm going to do that today and I will film it um, and I will put in uh, just the little time-lapse video of me creating the flag itself and I'm hoping it's going to turn out cute. Let's cross our fingers and dot our eyes. So, all right, let us give this a go. Yes. Oh my gosh, look, it came out so cute. I am in love with it. Um, you know, these flags are not made perfectly, so that's why this side didn't go all the way over because it's whatever, but it's the flag. It's not the, the um, whatever. Oh my gosh, I love it. And you can even see the bubbles. Oh, yes. I'm gonna go put it up right now. 
Oh my gosh, look at it. The wind's blowing. Oh, I love it. I think it turned out too cute. Cute! And this is the spring one, and it's, I mean, it's not faded at all. So that sublimation ink really works well. I mean, it's been out the whole springtime. Well, happy June 23rd to you. It's Friday. How'd your week go? I really did not do much of anything as far as studio work goes, except for making the flag, which I showed. Oh my gosh, y'all, I still love it. I think I'm going to put just the graphics on um, my Etsy store. I don't think I'm going to do a flag. Um, I don't know. Let me know what you think. Because uh, I can easily put it on there, but I have um, some great news. I just got the email. They're coming next week to do our fence. Not sure the day quite yet. Uh, they'll let us know a day or two before they come out, but the fence will be up next week and it cannot come soon enough. Yes! Uh, I don't want to go into it because I'm really trying my best to not give her any kind of attention whatsoever. But she started Wednesday with the landscaping guy who is part of the HOA and, you know, just drama. So I had to go down to the courthouse and to this tax assessor office, made some phone calls and all of that. So that was Wednesday and Thursday. Um, but I'm feeling good. I'm feeling confident. Um, you know, it, it's just unfortunate that this has happened because I just want to live peacefully in my neighborhood. I have no beef with anybody, never have. Uh, we have always just lived peacefully here for 25 years and for one person to disturb you is just, uh, it's just, I, I don't even have words for it. Um, and it's very, very, very obvious that she has some kind, something's going on up here that is not connecting with the rest of the world. Um, so part of me has, has got to kind of overlook it, the things that she says and does, because I don't know if she even really has control over it, if that makes any sense. Um... At least in my head, that's what's going on because no one in their right mind would act the way she acts. Unless you're just pure evil. Which, of course, there are pure evil people out there that want to steal joy from people and just want to make people miserable. I get that. I understand. But then again, those type of people, they do have some kind of a mental disorder to get off on that. So, I don't know, but I don't want to talk about her anymore. I have been working in the back though um, in anticipation of the fence. Uh, so I got new seats for my glider that is in the back. I've had this glider for probably 12 years. So it was time to replace the seats. The frame itself is perfectly fine, uh, but the seats finally started dry rotting. So I went ahead and replaced the seats. They're right there. I love them. I got them from Walmart. They were like $29 each. Had to get three. So I thought that was pretty reasonable. I mean, they're pretty thick. Here, let's show you. Max, it's Max approved. He loves it. But yeah, they're pretty thick, as you can see. Uh, they're probably about three inch, maybe more than that, maybe four. Four inches thick. So... But yeah, they will go, let me get, let me get to the better light. Uh, they'll go on the back. Um, it's been raining on and off all week long. Uh, so I probably won't replace them until tomorrow. Uh, and we do have an awning on the back there. And we're just going to try to clean the awning because the awning itself is like $70 to replace it. And it's beige. Uh, which would go with these covers because they do have a little bit of beige in them. But if we can just clean it, um, I think it, I'm hoping it'll get clean. But that's just all I've been doing this week. I'm about to go now. I gotta go get a chain for the chainsaw because we gotta cut down my bush, which makes me sad. So 
that's gonna be it for this vlog. I know it wasn't very long and not very interesting, but I'm hoping uh, next week um, that I can get back in the studio, work on my oil painting, I think, a little bit, and work on my fairy house. I think that'll be fun, so. Well, y'all have a great weekend, and y'all be good to one another. I'll see you later. Bye. I'm a sweaty mesh because let me show you why. You know my big plant? Yeah, it's gone. <sighs> Getting ready for the fence. Yes, bitch.